Have you ever experienced a profound shift in your life as if you were awakening to a new understanding of yourself and the world? Spiritual awakening is akin to a unique journey. It's not a straight path, but more like a DNA spiral. Some of us loop through various stages, others skip them entirely, and each journey is tailor-made to the individual while our paths may differ common elements. Unite us all. Today we are going to explore the five stages of spiritual awakening, keeping it simple and clear and offering insights into each stage to help you identify where you might be in your own journey. At the initial stage of the spiritual awakening journey, one exists deeply within the realm of the ego. It's a state where thoughts and emotions dominate without conscious awareness. Individuals identify closely with these thoughts and feelings believing them to be an al. Parts of their identity, the ego maintains a tight grip, leaving little room for a separation between the self and subjective experiences in this state. Individuals often react to life rather than actively shaping it. The sense of control is limited, leading to defensiveness, anger, and negativity. Life appears to unfold as if predetermined and any trauma. Encountered reinforces a belief in a lack of control in individuals, become entwined with their personal narratives, viewing life as something that happens to them rather than something they actively create during this stage. Seeing others clearly is challenging, as perception is filtered through the lens of one's own experiences and projections. This lack of clarity hinders genuine understanding of others fostering a skewed view of the world. The unconscious stage is characterized by a deep entanglement with the ego blurring the lines between the self and the external world. Embarking on the path of spiritual awakening begins with a profound realization a recognition of the imperative to liberate oneself from unconscious patterns and delve into the profound depths of existence. This pivotal moment signifies the commencement of a journey towards heightened self-awareness and a deeper connection to the profound intricacies of human existence. As individuals progress along this transformative journey, they inevitably encounter the stage known as ego death. This stage involves a profound dismantling of the ego, the subjective self that molds one's identity and perceptions. It entails a process of deconstruction where the identity constructed around societal labels such as gender, age, race, and beliefs is systematically dismantled. However, ego death is not a physical demise. Rather, it entails the dissolution of deeply entrenched beliefs about one's identity. Individuals come to the stark realization that the ego, the narrative they've constructed about themselves, is not the essence of their being all preconceived. Notions and concepts pertaining to life, God and religion are wiped clean, leaving behind a profound sense of emptiness and detachment. From this profound stripping away of the ego arises an internal space, a clear demarcation between the subjective self and the observer self in the prior unconscious stage, this observer self remained obscured. However, it now emerges into greater clarity. Individuals begin to grasp that they are not merely the sum of their thoughts, emotions, and ego-driven identity. Ego death precipitates an awakening to the presence of the observer self, the aspect that quietly observes and experiences life without becoming entangled in the narratives of the ego. This newfound awareness leads to the recognition that the ego is not the true essence of the self. Rather, it is a construct molded by societal conditioning, personal experiences, and learned behaviors. This pivotal stage prompts a profound shift in perspective, laying the groundwork for a deeper understanding of the self. The journey through ego death serves as a catalyst for recognizing the illusory nature of the ego and comprehending that the narrative one constructs about themselves does not define the core of their existence. It serves as a gateway to a more profound level of self-awareness, facilitating further exploration into the intricacies of consciousness and the nature of reality. Transitioning from ego death, the spiritual awakening journey progresses into a phase known as the search. Here individuals embark on a quest for deeper understanding driven by an innate yearning to uncover the fundamental truths of existence. This stage is 
characterized by a profound exploration of existential questions, such as the purpose of life and the nature of reality during the search phase, individuals cast a wide net in their quest for knowledge and insight. They may delve into spirit-spiritual literature, seek guidance from mentors or teachers, and explore various contemplative practices. The search is not merely an intellectual pursuit. It is fueled by a deep longing for clarity, meaning and connection as individuals navigate through this stage. They may find themselves drawn to spiritual practices that facilitate introspection and inner exploration, meditation, prayer, and contemplation, become integral tools for connecting with higher wisdom and uncovering deeper truths about the self and the universe. This phase is marked by a profound sense of curiosity and openness to new ideas and perspectives. Individuals eagerly absorb knowledge and wisdom that resonates with their evolving understanding of themselves and the world around them. Each new insight brings a sense of illumination and expands their awareness of the interconnectedness of all things. As the spiritual awakening journey unfolds, individuals reach a pivotal moment characterized by the emergence of the authentic self. This stage represents a profound shift away from societal conditioning and the conscious recognition of one's true nature during this phase, individuals begin to shed the layers of false identity and social masks they may have worn revealing their authentic essence beneath. They experience a growing discomfort with conformity and a deepening awareness of what truly aligns with their innermost being. This emergence of the authentic self often mirrors the innocence and purity of childhood. Before societal expectations and conditioning took hold, individuals become increasingly attuned to their genuine desires and aspirations, letting go of relationships, roles, and pursuits that no longer serve their true selves. In essence, the emergence of the authentic self marks a return to wholeness and alignment with one's deepest truths. It is a liberating journey of self-discovery and self-expression guided by an unwavering commitment to honoring the essence of who we truly are in the stage of alignment. Individuals embark on a journey of profound self-discovery and acceptance. They delve deep into their inner world, unraveling layers of conditioning and societal expectations to uncover the essence of their true being. This process of self-discovery is not always easy. It requires courage, vulnerability, and a willingness to confront uncomfortable truths. Yet through this introspective journey, individuals cultivate a deep sense of self-awareness and authenticity that serves as the foundation for living a life in alignment with their highest truth as individuals align with their true selves. They develop a greater sense of clarity and purpose in their lives. They no longer feel compelled to conform to external expectations or societal norms, but instead follow the guidance of their inner wisdom and intuition. This inner alignment empowers individuals to make decisions that are in alignment with their values, passions, and purpose, leading to a life filled with fulfillment and meaning. Living in alignment also fosters a profound sense of interconnected ESS with the world around them. Individuals recognize their inherent connection to all of creation and approach life with a deep reverence for the interconnected web of existence. This recognition of unity and interconnectedness inspires individuals to live in harmony with the natural world, fostering a deep sense of respect and stewardship for the earth and all its inhabitants. Furthermore, Alignment extends beyond the individual to encompass their relationships with others as individuals embody greater levels of self-love and acceptance. They are able to extend the same compassion and understanding to those around them. Relationships become a sacred space for growth, healing, and mutual support as individuals honor and celebrate each other's unique journey in essence. The stage of alignment represents a profound awakening to the interconnectedness of all life and a deep commitment to living in harmony with oneself, others, and the world. It is a journey of self-discovery, empowerment, and transformation that leads to a life filled with purpose, passion, and authentic expression. After reaching a life of alignment, individuals enter the integration phase where the profound 
insights and transformations from previous stages are consolidated into everyday life. This stage is about grounding spiritual awareness and embodying it in practice. ICAL day-to-day experiences during this phase, individuals apply their spiritual insights in real-world situations, making conscious choices that reflect their newfound understanding and values. Whether in relationships, work, or personal habits, the wisdom gained from the spiritual journey becomes second nature rather than being abstract. Concepts to ponder these insights are live truths leading to consistent actions that align with one's higher self. This stage demands a continuous and mindful effort to embody these spiritual principles in all aspects of life, creating a coherent and harmonious existence that reflects inner transformation. The integration phase also requires balancing the spiritual and material aspects of life. Individuals learn to navigate daily responsibilities while maintaining a deep spiritual connection, blending the mystical with the mundane seamlessly. This balance is not merely a static state, but a dynamic process that requires ongoing adjustment and awareness as integration deepens. There is a noticeable increase in emotional resilience. People can process emotions and experiences with greater ease recognizing them as part of the human journey rather than obstacles. This emotional resilience is built on a foundation of inner peace and understanding, which allows IND individuals to face challenges with a calm and centered approach. The phase is marked by a steady, ongoing evolution, even as the focus shifts from seeking new insights to refining and deepening existing ones. The practical application of spiritual wisdom becomes a cornerstone of this stage, with individuals finding a harmonious balance between their inner and outer worlds. This involves not only personal practices like meditation and mindfulness, but also extends to interactions with others and participation in society in relationships individuals communicate with, greater empathy and understanding, fostering deeper connections and resolving conflicts with compassion in the workplace. They bring integrity, creativity, and a sense of purpose, transforming their professional environment into a space that supports growth and well-being personnel habits, such as maintaining physical health, pursuing creative interests, and engaging in community service are aligned, with their spiritual values leading to a holistic approach to life. Moreover, the integration phase encourages individuals to become beacons of light and stability for others. By embodying their spiritual insights, they naturally inspire those around them, creating a ripple effect that promotes collective growth and harmony. This phase often leads to a profound sense of fulfillment and contentment as individuals realize that their everyday actions are expressions of their spiritual journey. They find joy in the simplicity of life, appreciating each moment as an opportunity to live their truth. This grounded, integrated approach to life fosters a deep sense of belonging and purpose, reinforcing the interconnectedness of all aspects of existence. In summary, the integration phase is a time of grounding, balancing and embodying spiritual wisdom in every facet of life. It is a dynamic and ongoing process of aligning inner transformations with outer realities, fostering resilience, compassion, and a holistic approach to living. This stage ultimately leads to a life that is not only spiritually aware, but also practically enriched, creating a foundation for continued growth and fulfillment. The final stage in the spiritual Awakening journey is the service phase where individuals feel a profound calling to use their insights and abilities to benefit others and contribute to the collective well-being. This stage is marked by an intense drive to find purposeful ways to contribute, whether through community work, teaching, healing, or other forms of service, the desire to serve is fueled by an increased sense of compassion and empathy for others leading to selfless actions aimed at alleviating suffering and promoting well-being, recognizing the interconnectedness of all beings. Individuals in this phase often engage in activities that uplift others and foster a sense of unity and collective consciousness. This recognition of oneness propels them to take steps that have a positive impact on the broader community, ensuring that their actions align with the principles of love and empathy. 
They have come to embrace many people in the service phase, become leaders or mentors, guiding others on their spiritual paths. They share their experiences and knowledge, helping others navigate their own journeys with greater ease and awareness. This phase is characterized by a commitment to raising collective consciousness, engaging in efforts that promote peace justice. Environment, mental sustainability, and social equity, such individuals often take on roles that allow them to influence and inspire, whether in formal positions of leadership or through everyday interactions, they understand that true leadership is about empowering others, and they strive to create environments where growth and enlightenment can flourish. Their mentorship is often marked by patience, understanding, and a deep sense of responsibility toward those they guide. The fulfillment derived from this stage comes from the joy and satisfaction of contributing to the greater good by serving others and witnessing the positive impact of their efforts. Individuals experience a profound sense of purpose and connection. This sense of purpose is not just a fleeting feeling, but a deeply rooted understanding that their lives have significant meaning. They see the results of their actions in the improved lives of others, the strengthened communities, and the heightened awareness of collective well-being. This phase of service represents the outward expression of spiritual wisdom as individuals channel their inner transformation into actions that benefit the world, embodying the principles of compassion, altruism, and interconnectedness. Moreover, the service phase encourages a continuous cycle of learning and teaching, as individuals give of themselves. They also receive valuable insights and experiences that further their own spiritual growth. This exchange enriches their understanding and reinforces the idea that service is not a one-way street, but a reciprocal flow of energy and wisdom. They find that through serving others, they are also serving themselves nurturing their own spiritual evolution in the process. This stage also fosters a deep appreciation for the diversity of the human experience as individuals encounter and support people from various walks of life, each with their unique challenges and gifts. In summary, the service phase is a culmination of the spiritual awakening journey where individuals turn their inner transformation outward to make a meaningful impact on the world. It is a stage characterized by purposeful contribution, compassionate leadership, and the joy of selfless service by embodying and expressing their spiritual insights through actions that uplift and support others. Individuals in this phase demonstrate the true essence of spiritual awakening, living in harmony with oneself in the world and contributing to the collective evolution of humanity. This phase signifies a mature and integrated spiritual consciousness where the journey of personal growth transforms into a mission of universal love and compassion.